Hey y'all. So you know I've been working on this uh, boat with the inboard six and a half horsepower Predator motor. We're out here at Ted's Pond today. He offered up the pond because he wants to see if it's going to sink or not. And that's why these two are here. You remember Dawson from uh, hanging the, uh, the hoist out there in his garage. So uh, I know what you're thinking. Chris, you ain't got no friends maybe a little bit more your age? <laughs> Well, we're the rescue squad. <laughs> what could I say? I, I make friends of every age. All right, so we're going to go out here and see what we can make happen. All right, y'all. So as it turns out, Ted's got a bridge out here. So since none of the electronics are on this boat yet, we're just uh, seeing if it floats and seeing if the drivetrain works. We're going to work from this bridge. So what we're going to do is we're going to set it right down there. Oh, we got target practice going on over there. You can see the propeller down there. Got our stuffing box there. For those of you that haven't seen the previous videos, there's our drivetrain. Turn the propeller so we can see what's going on there. Got us a clutch right there. Hit a freewheel until the engine engages, and then everything begins to turn. All right, we're gonna set it in the water. I trust you. I, you can call Chris a crack guy in his own camera. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I, I've edited that out of previous videos. Right, we're going to walk this way, and then I'm going to get down the water right here. Pick it up. That's going to be slippery and muddy. Yeah, I'll be out. I hope that water doesn't go It probably will. It will immediately. Right. Not heavy. Not much, but it is a little bit. Alright, so if we waited a little bit at the back. Yeah. Y'all see any water coming in yet? I no. Any. Camera don't see any. <laughs> Good job, cameraman. Hey. Alright, Matt. I'm going to put it over there. You hang on to it a second. I'm going to give it a little bit of weight in the back so it's not leaning so bad. I told you, uh, you're going. Matthew, yeah, look right. under the motor. Look under the motor. On this side? Up front under the motor. Oh, we're leaking a little bit over there. Well, that's what we're looking at under the motor, up front. All right. Make it a crank. <laughs> you don't have an electric starter on it? Nah. Electronics on it's gonna have plenty of go. Well, that's what I just, just like when it first charged you over there. <laughs> yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Now, when you when you got them electronics on it and you open it up, well, it's gonna be running over the 
the driveway down there before <laughs> you can get it slowed down again. I got a big anchor at home. It'll it'll work on that. Well, when you let off the fuel, it should slow down pretty quick. Okay. Oh, all right, Judy, get over in there. No. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean, no? No. Look how much weight it will hold. Get in there. Dad. Now you. It ain't gonna hold that much. <laughs> Man, I can't believe how much thrust it's got when you just barely hit it. I can't imagine you not knowing. Come on, Judy. Come on, Judy. Hey, is there any way we can get the boat in on it? Nah, it's too heavy. <laughs> hey, we're going to call test number one out here on the water a success. I'd like to thank all my friends for coming out and helping me out. Ted for the pond to test it in. I'm Chris from Key Farm. Love God, love people, and click on some of these other videos. <laughs>